Hi, everybody. We begin tonight with breaking news in Hartford. Union Station just reopened a few minutes ago there. It was closed for more than an hour as police combed the building looking for a murder suspect. All of this started around 3 o'clock this afternoon at the train and bus station on Union Place. News H's Jamie Muro is there live. Jamie, what can you tell us so far? Well, I can tell you earlier, it really did look like a police state out here. You can see there are still some state trooper cars that are here. State police was called in as a backup. But actually, this is Union Place right here. During this whole situation, Union Place, which runs right in front of Union Station here, this was shut down. Police were everywhere. Let's show you some video. When we rolled up here around 345, 4 o'clock, we saw state troopers holding assault rifles. They were spread out on the first level of Union Station. When you look up top to where the platform was, we saw police up there holding assault rifles. Hartford police was out here in force. We're being told kind of a nondescript really explanation that they were looking for someone. There are rumors that perhaps this was a person who is a murder suspect from out of state that might have been spotted here back live now. What this also did, and they finally opened up Union Place here. You can see the cars going by now. We saw an Amtrak train running. Probably going to be some delays there for what happened. But what was happening is this whole area was getting so congested because with several streets, or this street shut down, they were running buses here, parking them everywhere, letting people get on buses there because they weren't allowing passengers either onto buses or trains. But again, Union Station now opened up a small police presence, and we're still trying to get information. Hopefully going to give you an update very soon. For now, though, we're live in Hartford. Jamie Miro, News 8.